Hey everybody, it is Fun Friday! Round of applause! Yes! Uh, let's see, well, first of all, woke up feeling really good. I think I'm getting more sleep, um, which has been, you know, giving me a lot more energy through the day, and I ran almost nine miles! Yay! And it was perfect weather. So, now what do I have up my sleeve for you today? Uh, I'm going to, of course, give you the John Prine of the day, uh, tell you a little bit about my Huntington's, um, that's not what I meant to say, my uh, John Prine concert experiences, and finally end with my fish joke, which is also going to make you guys either laugh or cry. Okay, <clears throat> so I have been to three John Prine concerts. My first one was with my mama, and I think we are in uh, Brattleboro, Vermont, something with a B. Um, and there were people sitting here, a couple of them close to us. And uh, during the songs, it was just funny because they were snapping like this. And we were just, oh, that's funny. And then after John Prine, when John Prine was playing uh, Let's Talk Dirty in Hawaii, they got up and left and they were just so outraged by the inappropriateness of the joke. And then me and mom were like, they obviously aren't true John Prine fans if they got offended by his uh, terrible song. Uh, so that was the first one that I went to. Well, then I was planning on going to another one probably uh, two or three years ago. It's supposed to be me and my um, ex-husband and a couple friends of ours had driven up um, from Boston and we were in Rochester. Um, and I had purchased the tickets for us, so it's kind of, you know, it's time to go get in the car and we pull up the map on the, you know, uh, phone. And it turns out that I bought the tickets for the wrong location, which was like a seven hour drive. Uh, so I was just so heartbroken because the friends were here and I was like, oh, but I, I have a tendency to buy stuff, you know, or map stuff in the wrong state or city. Uh, it's kind of common for me, but it was just one of those. And I still had the ticket, like, just to remind myself of how sad that was. But now I can kind of laugh about it. So, uh, let's see. And then the next, I went to one concert with my brother and sister-in-law. Um, and that's, that, at that concert, that's when I noticed that John Prine, like, taps one foot, I think his left foot, like, with the music. Um, and so now every time I go to a concert, I have to see that he's doing his cool leg thing and I can do a pretty good uh, impression of it. I won't bore you with that though. Uh, and then finally the most recent concert I was pregnant. Uh, it was in December and uh, I was worried because it was going to be a five-hour drive and I was pregnant and I was like if there's a snowstorm I'm going to not be able to go as I'm really nervous uh, just because it's like you know it would be another concert I didn't get to go to that I was supposed to uh, but it was so nice it was so nice it was not it was like 40 50 degrees um, and it was the day before my birthday um, so five hour drive pregnant me you know had to stop every hour to pee uh but which was you know pretty funny but i got to meet up with my uh, cousins and aunt and uncle who are huge john prine fans um so it's just really fun to have everybody there um and i had really good seats too so that was my last uh concert experience and now my hope this is it's on my bucket list but to see John Prine in Red Rocks, because I've never been to Red Rocks before, um, and it would just be awesome to be able to have those, you know, first time at Red Rocks and seeing John Prine. But I don't even know if he plays at Red Rocks anymore, but also the other plan is, I think almost always he plays in the Bluegrass Festival uh, in Telluride, and uh, my sister-in-law and I found the dates, and so the plan is to drive out there for that one. And hopefully he uh, is playing in that concert. Uh, so that's my John Prine ticket stories. Uh, now um, I bore you with my fish joke. Okay.
What do you call a fish with no eyes? Wait for it. A fish. <laughs> okay, yes. Uh, that, that's it. I think that's all. Fun Fridays usually go pretty fast. Uh, and the song I'm going to choose is Grandpa Was a Carpenter. I love that song. Well, I love every John Prine song. Uh, but that's going to be your John Prine song of the day. I hope everybody's having a good start to your weekend. And I look forward to talking when I have more to say. Have a good weekend.